I was born in Haiti and I was adopted when I was 13 months and uh, I lived with my family in Winkler for 13 years before moving to Winnipeg. Uh, growing up in a Christian household, my parents always believed in prosperity, healing, so we just, we always just grew up knowing that. After high school, I left home. I kind of went through the phase of where I thought I knew everything in life. I know my ABCs about Christianity. I went to a Christian school, grown up a Christian, so I definitely had that, I had that mindset towards my parents that I just felt that they needed to just let me go and just, you know, I just need to prove to them that, you know, I can handle this. During the year and eight months, I just felt like nothing was getting accomplished in my life. I felt alone, even though I had tons of friends. I remember my mom, she would always send me emails and kind of just texting me, just things just saying, you know, like, um, you know, God loves you, I love you, you know, if you're ready to come home, we're ready for you to come home anytime. And it took me a year and eight months to realize that, but eventually I came around. My mom just really needed me to, you know, just make the decision of, you know, just am I going to live for God or am I going to just live the life that I want to live kind of thing. So uh, she just basically said, you know, you know, we need you to come to church every Sunday. And um, if you can't live by these rules, then, you know, it, then maybe it's just better for you to just live on your own again. How my life has changed being plugged into Springs, well, it's changed a lot, you know, just not just showing up to services, but just volunteering in media, Springs Youth, dance, even just other things like being a part of uh, Springs Sports, having, being a part of the dodgeball team, like I've met my fiance through dodgeball, so I can honestly say that uh, being a part of dodgeball has changed my life. Um, yeah, so just getting plugged in and not just showing up to services every Sunday, but just giving your time because and seeing other people's lives being changed has changed my life.